This video guides students on the creation of the final product. Before we begin, let's have first the objectives. At the end of the lesson, you will be able to Determine the different elements of arts and principle of designs in creating artworks by completing the crossword puzzle and apply artistic skills and techniques in process of creation. Elements of art. These are the basic elements that are used by artists in creating art. They are what you use to create an aesthetically pleasing work. When we make art, we need to understand and apply these seven elements of art. First, line. A mark made by a pointed tool such as a brush, pen, or stick, or a moving point. These are the different kinds. Second, shape. A flat, enclosed area that has two dimensions, length and width. Artists use a both a geometric and organic shapes. Geometric shapes are rigid, severe, and confining, while organic shapes are fluid, free, and natural. Third, color is one of the most dominant elements. It is created by light. There are three properties of color. First is the hue, or the color itself, such as green, blue, yellow, and then we have the value. It's the shades and the tints. The lightness or darkness of a color. I do white to get lightness or black for darkness. And lastly, the intensity. It is the brightness or darkness, dullness of a color. Fourth is a value. Degrees of lights or darkness. The difference between values is called value contrast. Fifth is the form. Objects that has three dimensional having length width and height. They can be viewed from many sides. Forms take up space and a volume. Sixth is a texture. Describes the feel of an actual surface. The surface quality of an object can be real or implied. Seventh and last is the space. It is used to create the illusion of death. Space can be two-dimensional, three-dimensional, negative and or positive. There are six ways to create the illusion of space. Kindly see the illustration below. Principles of Design These are the standard rules to be observed by artists in creating works of art. They are how to create and organize artwork. When elements are utilized with the principles in mind, outstanding artwork is created. First is the balance, a distribution of visual weight on either side of the vertical axis. Symmetrical balance uses the same characteristics. Asymmetrical uses different but equally weighted features. Second is contrast. It is the arrangement of opposite elements, just like light versus dark, a rough versus smooth, small versus large, and etc. In a composition, so as to create a visual interest. Third is emphasis. It is used to make certain parts of an artwork stand out. It creates the center of interest or focal point. It is the place in which an artist draws your eye to first. Fourth is the movement. It's how the eye moves through the composition, leading the attention of the viewer from one aspect of the work to another. It can create the illusion of action. Pattern, the repetition of specific visual elements such as a unit of shape or form, a method used to organize surfaces in a consistent or regular manner. Sixth is the rhythm. A regular repetition of or alternation and elements to create a cohesiveness and interest. Seventh and the last is unity. Visually pleasing agreement among the elements in a design. It is the feeling that everything in the work of art works together and looks like it fits. Before ending this video, I just want to share with you from Ralph Waldo Emerson, I quote, Every artist was first an amateur. So guys, practice makes a progress. That's it mga artists I hope you learned something from me today. Goodbye!